Hey everybody, it's Crystal and I wanted to make this video to address you know, some of the comments that have been made to me and um, I just made a video about how a lot of them absolutely make me laugh and none of them will ever change who it is that I am or what I'm doing because that's just, that's not gonna happen. But I do wanna talk to the people who feel this need to absolutely shame, demean and eviscerate other people online. I don't know what's going on. Like this has been happening since the dawn of time, people have been gossiping and backbiting and they've been taking shots. That's normal and human to some degree. But something is happening and changing that gives people the perceived permission to be absolutely despicable to one another. And especially people who they perceive have vulnerable parts. People who show their heart. People who show their spirit or want to help or are trying to do something of value and merit. Those are the people that often get attacked and demeaned and people seem to want to level them. I don't get it. Well, I do get it actually, and here's why it happens. When you shine a light, there's always an opposing reaction that takes place and it's usually of a lower vibration or darkness. So when you're out there putting your heart into it, which is what I do, putting your soul and spirit into it, there's going to be the reverberating effect in the darkness, which is just an energetic thing. It's not that they're evil or bad. They're just not hanging out in the vibration that I am. And so they get antagonized or they seek to find ways to change my energy or vibration. And so they attack me and they attack others. Those are the people that I'm actually making this video for because I want to challenge you about that. I want you to understand and get that even though you may be taking this very lightly and you may think, oh, I'm just being a troll and let me see if I can get a reaction or, or maybe you're somebody out there who really gets off on making somebody cry or making somebody doubt themselves or feel bad about like, if that's you, I'm sorry for that, but maybe that's you. I just want you to know that for every comment that you leave and for every thought and intention about this that you have, there is a karmic response and reaction. There is an evidence that comes from that. And it's typically not in my life. It's in yours. When you perpetuate vitriol and when you perpetuate hate and harm and damage, sure, you're going to hurt people and that sucks and I wish you wouldn't. But most of all, you hurt your damn self every single time it comes back on you times three, times 10, times whatever, but you hurt yourself because people like me, I don't know you don't care to, this isn't going to bother me. Sometimes it does, I'm going to be honest, but this isn't really going to change my life if you leave me a terrible comment. It changes your life though, and it solidifies a pattern and an energy that you are caught up in. Aim higher. Aim higher. Do better. Try to figure out what your heart is, where it is, what that feels like, what the energy is like. How can you grow that and then express it out from yourself and help people? Like, how do you get in touch with that? I want to challenge you to really take everything you think, do, say very seriously for as a man speaks, so he is. You're not required to like me. And in fact, if we're not a fit, that's perfect for me. I don't need you to be spending time with me because that's going to cause an antagonistic situation. Fine. Keep it moving. Much love to you. But if you don't like me, or other people, or if you see something that you want in somebody else, but you know that you don't have it because it just shines a light on what you lack. Stop a minute. Don't react with hate, vitriol, and shaming somebody else. Do a little introspective work. You're a human being here for a reason. Like you could be helping the situation out. You actually could be a blessing to somebody. You could bless somebody and tell them they're doing great. Keep it up. You could come from a different place and change the world. But I don't know what's going on. Like, I don't know. Maybe you hear that. Maybe you don't. But bet your bottom dollar and don't you forget that there is an evidence that accompanies your bad behavior and it's all about your choice. Make the right choice. Now for everybody else out there who I don't get to talk to because I don't check my comment section because there's these people who are being terrible often. For those of you though that are trying to reach me, please write me at my email address because I read those emails and I get them and I, I respond to each and every one. It takes me a little while, but I do respond. My email address is crystal at crystalancompton.com or alternatively, please go to my Facebook page and 
hang out there because I'm there every single day and for whatever reason we've got a community of thousands of people who don't feel the need to crap all over other people and if they do they are blocked and banned bye bye I'm not about it life's too short check me out over there talk to me over there because I love interacting with people who are at my level or higher or into it or like turned on activated awakening I'm I love that and I do want to know who you are and I do want to interact with you. All other people, man, I just wish you blessings, some illumination, and that you would take your personal inventory and don't forget the evidences that you're causing in your own life.